Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Blessings to you all on YouTube tonight. God bless each and every one of you on TikTok Live tonight. We're also going to be on Instagram as well as Facebook Live. Yes, there's four devices that I have up right now. Amen. Because there's four platforms. Amen. That God has called me to. I want to welcome each and every one of you on Facebook Live tonight. Amen. I am Apostle Carmen Haywood. Amen. I am the senior pastor of PIPW Ministry and we are located here in Raleigh, North Carolina. I bring you Greetings on Instagram, Facebook Live, YouTube, and also TikTok Live on tonight. Glory to God. Listen, um, those of you on TikTok that are joining, go ahead and share. Amen with your followers tonight. Those on Instagram, share with your followers. Those of you, amen, on Facebook Live tonight, click that share button. Amen. Share with your followers. God bless you. God bless you, each and every one of you that is on tonight. Listen, there is a word from the Lord. Hallelujah. Some of you may have seen the caption already, but there is a word from the Lord. Listen, we're going to get started early. Amen. I'm going to give you all what I would usually give you at the end of the message or at the end of the live. I would always tell you the seed amount. Amen. But God is telling me to give it to you early tonight. Amen. Because so many people, amen, they get on and they receive the word. Amen. But they don't seal the word. Hallelujah. So the seed amount tonight is 40. Amen. And that is the coming out seed. Amen. The seed amount tonight is 40. And that is the coming out seed. God bless you, Bishop Whitfield on TikTok tonight. Once again, we are on YouTube. We are on Facebook Live. We're also on Instagram Live. And we are on TikTok Live tonight. Four platforms. Amen. Four devices that I got going on right now. God bless you, my brother Malachi. Listen, but we are here. Amen. But the seed amount tonight is 40. Listen, you can go ahead and sow your seed. Amen. The information should be in the message. You should be able to see it. If you can't see it, I'll give it in just a little bit. Amen. But I want to encourage you tonight to tell you that God said, yes, you are tried in the fire, but you're coming out with the victory. Hallelujah. Many of you, this word is for you. So stay here, grab your Bibles, get your notepad, get your ink pen. Amen. Glory to God. Get ready to take down some notes. Listen, I've been holding this word for three days. Hear me and hear me well. I've been holding this word for three whole days, three whole days. Amen. And when God gave it to me, Sister Nakresha, three days ago, amen. Then two days ago, he said, release my word. And I said, yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Then today, God said, release my word to my people. And I said, yes, Father, I will be obedient and release your word to your people. So with that being said, we're going to get started. Hallelujah. And I have to be obedient to the Lord. Amen. And give you the seed amount early. That's what God said to do. Amen. Because because there's many of you that come and, you know, sometimes the broadcast is two hours long, three hours long, and you don't have an opportunity to sow. Amen. But there's some of you that can sow a $40 seed tonight. God said there's some of you that can sow $140 tonight. There's some of you that can sow $240, $340, $440. And this is what God told me. Amen. He said there's some of you that can sow beyond $40. Amen. But make sure that there's a $40 in your seed tonight. Amen. Glory to God. Make sure that there's a 40 in your seed tonight. All right. Whether it's 140, 540, 740, whatever. However, amen. A thousand and forty dollars. Listen, hallelujah. Somebody may say, Apostle, amen. Why do we have to sow? Listen, we sow to seal the word. Glory to God. Amen. It's like sealing the deal. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Glory to God. It's like sealing. Amen. What God has given you. Why? Because the enemy, he comes to pluck up the word and he does it all the time. The Bible says, says it in the book of Matthew. It talks about how the word is the seed, but what the enemy does is he comes to pluck it up. Amen. And he does a very good job at it. <laughs> That's why some of you go to church and after you go to church, there's no more word. Come on here. You can't even say what the pastor preached. Amen. Or what the guest prophet, amen, said to you. Why? Because you haven't sealed the word. Amen. So tonight the seed amount is 40. Glory to God. And name your seed, my coming out seed. I'm coming out of this with the victory in my hand. Glory to God. Once again, thank you all for the hearts on TikTok. Y'all know what to do. Send up those um, hearts on TikTok. Send up some gifts. Matter of fact, I'm going to go ahead. Amen. And set this goal early <laughs> tonight. Amen. On TikTok. Glory to God. I can set a goal, y'all. I can set a goal. Amen. On TikTok. And I'm going to do just that. Is that all right? 
Hallelujah. I'm going to pin it right there. Amen. And let TikTok know what the goal is tonight. Amen. So that they can send up those hearts and those gifts. Amen. Which um, also helps the ministry. Glory to God. And so we thank God for it. We thank God for everything. Listen, I don't know about anybody else, but I'm grateful. Amen. I'm grateful. God bless you, Sister Latoya. I'm praying for you, as you already know. Hallelujah. I'm praying for PIPW ministry. I love, amen, the members and covenant partners of PIPW ministry. Pastor is praying for you all. Amen. That you will win. But not only win, but that hallelujah, you'll be able to fight against the wiles of the devil. Amen. That you'll be able to fight. Amen. Every diabolical entity that is coming against your progress, that is coming against your family, coming against hallelujah, your ministry. My God, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And I pray tonight. Hallelujah. Glory to God. That PIPW ministry be the first partakers of the word. Hallelujah. Because there's so many souls out there that need this word tonight. Hallelujah. But I cover, amen, PIPW ministry in the blood of Jesus. And I'm grateful. I don't know about anybody else, <laughs> but I greet you all in Jesus name. Thank you all for the greetings tonight. Listen, click that share button. Come on, put this message on your timeline. Amen. Why don't you uh, tag somebody into the broadcast tonight? Listen, hallelujah. I want to tell you early, amen, that we have prophetic mentorship um, classes that will start October the 1st. All right. October the 1st. Amen. YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. Glory to God. Listen, amen. You want to take prophetic mentorship. Why do you need to take prophetic mentorship? Because you may be one that is a prophet or one that has a prophetic anointing on your life. Hear me and hear me well. You want to be seasoned in the prophetic. Amen. You, you want to glory to God. You want to be able to prophesy as the spirit of the Lord leads you to prophesy. Amen. You want to be like the prophets of old glory to God. And even some of you may carry the anointing of the prophets, but you got to know what to do with it. Hallelujah. So these classes, amen, are a blessing in your life. Glory to God. And so, yes, the registration, amen, is $200. And that's for all four classes. Amen. All four classes. And you will receive a certificate at the very end of the class. Hallelujah. Some of you already took um, prophetic mentorship. And I have a lot of students, amen, that always come back and take the class again, 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 and again. Glory to God. Hallelujah. But we talk about the prophets in the Bible. Come on, from A to Z. Glory to God. So you're going to learn so much, amen, in the uh, prophetic mentorship. We talk about what is a prophet, amen, what is a seer, what is the prophetic, hallelujah, the office of the prophet. Come on here. Hallelujah. We talk about prophetic training and what that means, amen. We talk about church government. We talk about protocol. Amen. And the ministry of prophecy. Hallelujah. We also talk about glory to God, how God established church government. Amen. In the class, we talk about amen protocol within the church, in the local church, and even in the church. Amen. That God may send you on assignment to go and minister to. Hallelujah. Listen, we talk about everything. Amen. That is necessary in the prophetic. So those of you that are prophets, you need to take this class. Amen. And those of you that have a prophetic calling on your life or a prophetic anointing on your life, you need to take prophetic mentorship. Amen. We also talk about repentance and how the prophet, hallelujah, has to get to a place of repentance and stay in the place of repentance when it comes to God. Amen. Not just being a prophet, one who is prophesying, but also, amen, a prophet who is connected to God for real. Amen. So here is the packet. Amen. You will also receive a spiral notebook and an ink pen. All right. So you'll get everything in your packet. All right. But some of you need to register tonight. Okay. Prophetic mentorship. Glory to God. Amen. These are the classes that are coming up. And once again, the date is October the 1st, the 8th, the 15th, and the 22nd. All right. Amen. In the month of October, we're going to start October the 1st. So those of you that want to take prophetic mentorship, feel free to inbox me tonight. Amen. On social media, you can inbox me and say, Apostle Carmen, I would love to take prophetic mentorship classes in the month of October. Amen. Glory to God. And we will talk, amen, about your registration. Listen, tonight is going to be great. Amen. Tonight is going to be awesome. God bless you all on TikTok. I can see y'all tonight. Listen, hit those hearts, send up some gifts. Amen. 
there on TikTok. But let us pray. Hallelujah. Let us pray. Those of you on Facebook, go ahead and share tonight. Amen. Um, daughter Kamaya, can you please share in our groups on Facebook? Can you share Kamaya um, in our group chats? Amen. And also the ministry page. Amen. Or oh, Sister Latoya, if you can hop on over to Facebook for me. Amen. And go ahead on and share. Thank you all for the greetings tonight. Hallelujah. The spirit of the Lord is here. And the Bible says where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. Glory to God. Hallelujah. There is freedom. Hallelujah. In the spirit of God. And how many of you know, amen, that God's spirit is here. Hallelujah. The Bible says where two or three are gathered, he is in the midst. Hallelujah. The Bible also says, amen, that he's Jehovah Shammah, which means he is the God who is there. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. He's the God. Hallelujah. That is there for each and every one of us. The Bible says that he'll never leave us nor forsake us. He'll be with us even until the ends of the earth. Thank you for sharing, Sister Margaret. You got the right vision. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. See, the woman of God came on and she started sharing. She started tagging some people. See, some of y'all on here, amen, just so you can be greedy tonight and get the word for yourself. No, 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 and no. That's not how you do it. Hallelujah. Because you're going to be blessed anyway. Amen. But the way to be blessed is to bless somebody else. Mm. <laughs> God bless you, Sister Adina. Hallelujah. The way to be blessed, glory to God, is to bless somebody else. Some of y'all going to catch that. But I need you to catch it tonight. I don't want you to catch it next week. I need you to catch it tonight. Hallelujah. Because what you do, glory to God, what you do for somebody else, God in turn would do for you. Somebody got their answer early. Mm. Hey, hallelujah. Somebody got their answer early. <laughs> some of y'all afraid to tag some people. Some of y'all afraid to click that share button. Amen. Because you don't want this video on your timeline. But the truth of the matter is, amen. If you're not happy with the fountain, amen, that is pouring into your life, then how can you be blessed? Come on here. Hallelujah. How can you be blessed? No, you got to be satisfied with the fountain. Amen. That is pouring into your life. And then you got to tell somebody else. Hallelujah. If you look all throughout scripture, glory to God, those that were healed. Amen. Or those who experienced Jesus, what did they do? They told somebody else. Hallelujah. The woman with the issue of blood, as soon as she got healed, amen, she began to tell the people, she said, my blood has stopped. Shanda by Soya. Hallelujah. She said, wait a minute. I was bleeding. I had an issue. Amen. For 12 long years, but I'm, I'm no longer bleeding. Woo, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. See, those that got healed and those that got delivered, glory to God, they immediately told other people what Jesus has done. <laughs> she said, come see a man. Hallelujah. That told me all about myself. That's the woman at the well. <laughs> come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Hey, Shanda Basoya. Glory to God. The woman at the well. Glory to God. Jesus began to speak to her. Amen. And began to prophesy to her. And she said, wait a minute. It's no way that you could have known all of that stuff. Hallelujah. So the woman at the well, amen, after Jesus had spoke to her and said, this water that I'm going to give you, you shall never thirst again. Woo! Haya! Shanda basoya. I feel the fire of God on this live already. Hallelujah. Listen, she said, you, he, Jesus said, you shall never thirst again. And then she began to immediately tell the people, she said, come see a man that told me all about myself. <laughs> hey! Glory to God. She couldn't hold it. To herself, Minister Derek, she said, listen, I got to tell. <laughs> I got to tell the people, hallelujah, about what I've experienced. Come on, somebody. But we got the saints that get on live and they don't want to share nothing. Hiya. They don't want to sow. They don't want to support. They just want to eat, 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 and eat. Well, guess what? After a while, you get so fat and full. And if you're not applying what, you're, what, you're, what is being poured into your spirit, then there's no manifestation. But for those of you that are sharing, thank you. God says, thank you. <laughs> Hallelujah for sharing my prophet. God says, thank you. I hear it in my ear. He's talking very clearly tonight. He says, thank you for sharing my word and sharing my message. Woo. Hallelujah. We got to stop being so stingy. Woo. Well, we got, come on church. I don't know who I'm talking to right here. Thank you, sister Latoya. Cause guess what's going to happen when you share, you're going to feel better too. Hey, glory to God. When you share, you're going to feel better. It's all right. We got a thumbs down. I'm going to give y'all some love. You ready? Here it is. Take it, take it, take it. <laughs> glory to God. There's some love on Instagram. Hallelujah. God bless you. God bless you. Listen, listen. 
Hallelujah. Be begin to share. Hallelujah. Begin to be one that shares. Hallelujah. Share the love. Come on. Spread the gospel. Hallelujah. Share other ministries. Come on. Why are we so stiff and so, so, so just so messed up? Jesus, have mercy. Hallelujah. I remember, amen, when I was serving other leaders and serving other pastors, I told the whole community about my church. Hallelujah. I was telling the community. I was telling even my clients whose hair I was doing. I said, listen, you need to come to my church. You need to hear my pastor preach. Hey, glory to God. I wasn't trying to take them for myself. Hallelujah. Even though I had a prayer line and had a ministry, I said, listen, you need to see my pastor. You, you need to come to my church. You, uh, whew, hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Because I was grateful that I got saved for real, for real. I was grateful that I got delivered for real, for real. I was grateful that I got healed for real, for real. Come on, somebody. And you can't contain this. Hey, that's why Jeremiah said it's like fire. <laughs> Y'all know the word. Hallelujah. It's like fire, Brother Antonio. Shut up in my bones. Hey, I got to tell somebody, hallelujah, about this wonderful Jesus. I got to tell somebody that he still heals. Huh? He still saves. He still delivers and he still sets free. Because he set me free. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. He set me free. Come on. Some of y'all need to go back down memory lane. Woo. See, we done got so grown in the spirit. Y'all not going to talk back to me tonight, but I'm going to keep on talking. We done got so grown in the spirit. Amen. That we think we know everything. But sometimes we got to go back down memory lane and remember when God saved us. Remember when he healed us. Come on. Remember when he called you. Hallelujah. By your name. Glory to God. Not to preach, pray, and prophesy, but he called you. Hallelujah. So that he could save you. Somebody shout, I'm saved for real, for real. Hey. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody shout, I'm saved for real, for real. Hallelujah. If Jesus was to appear in the sky in the next five minutes, uh, hallelujah, I'm going to be caught up to meet him. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Because before the house, uh, hallelujah, I asked him for the Holy Ghost. Come on here. Before the car, I asked him for his spirit. Oh, y'all not going to talk back to me tonight, but I'm going to keep on talking. Come on, Jesus. Come on in this room, God. Hallelujah. Come on in this space, Lord, and have your way on tonight. Uh, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Shavonda says, my, my, I remember. Woo. See, I remember that day. <laughs> I remember, listen, I got delivered on a Friday night. I remember that day. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. And yes, hands was laid on me. Come on. Oh, y'all not going to talk back to me tonight, but I'm going to keep on talking. Hallelujah. The devil, amen, was cast out of me. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, <laughs> come on, church, where you at tonight? Hallelujah. Come on, somebody, because I needed to be free. I needed to be delivered. I, hey, Shanda Basoya. Hallelujah. God knew what I needed. Come on here. He knew, glory to God, that he had called me. Amen. So I couldn't go the way that I was going and keep doing the same thing the way that I was doing it. Amen. Because not only that, I was going to cause shipwreck for somebody else. Ah. Uh. So he had to clean me up for real, for real. Come on, somebody. And not clean me up to prophesy or to preach. Hallelujah. But, but he cleaned me up. Hey, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. So that I can hear well done. Woo. My good and faithful servant. Hallelujah. He said, you've been faithful over a few things. I'm going to make you ruler over many. Enter into the joy of the Lord. <laughs> Hallelujah. Listen, God saves us. Hallelujah. To be a light in this dark world. He saves you so that your family will know that Jesus is real. Come on, somebody. He saves us. Hey, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. She said parking lot of the liquor store. You better go ahead and testify. Hallelujah. You better go ahead on and testify. Ha, ah, glory to God. You better go ahead on and testify. Mm. We done got away from testimony services. We done got away from testifying because we done got grown in the spirit. We, we think we know everything. Come on here. But sometimes, Brother Antonio, God got to bring you low. Ooh, Shanda Basoya. Sometimes, TikTok, God got to bring you low. He said, listen, I cleaned you up. I delivered you. I'm the one that set you free. Don't forget. <laughs> For the Bible says, glory to God, that God loads us up with benefits every day. So we, we are to not forget his benefits. We are not to forget what God has done for us. I'll never forget what the Lord has done for me. 
Hallelujah. Some, sometimes, amen, Prophet Cornell, it brings me to tears. Woo, Shanda Basoya. Hallelujah. Sometimes, glory to God, it brings me to tears. Hallelujah. And it keeps me humble. Hallelujah. To the point to where I say, God, I thank you. Mm. Hallelujah. God, I thank you. Hallelujah for pulling me out. Who glory to God. Hallelujah of a horrible life of sin. Come on, somebody. Some people would say, amen, it wasn't horrible, but yes, it was horrible. Amen. Hallelujah. Because I was on a fast train to hell. I don't know about nobody else. Woo. I don't know about nobody else. Hey, Shanda Basoya, but I know where I was headed. Come on here. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We give God praise, amen. We give God glory <laughs> for salvation, amen. I'm laughing in the spirit, hallelujah, because God is touching somebody. Woo, Shanda Basoya, God is touching somebody. Hallelujah, the song says, I am grateful for the things that you have done. Yes, I'm grateful for the victories We've won. I could go on and on and on about your works. Yes, God. Because I'm grateful, grateful, so grateful just to praise you, Lord. Flowing from my heart, flowing from, I hear it, my heart. Are the issues, are the issues of my heart is what is gratefulness. <laughs> Hallelujah. You know, sometimes you got to just sing the song of the Lord. Hallelujah. And that is the song of the Lord. I'm grateful. Mm. Haya. Shanda Basoya. Before I preach to the masses, I got to give them glory. I said before. I, okay. 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 But before, hallelujah, I release the word of the Lord to you and prophesy to some of you. Amen. And minister to some of you and pull you out of the pit that you are in on tonight. Hallelujah. I got to give God glory. Woo. Hiya. And let them know that I'm grateful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm so grateful. Amen. I'm so grateful. Woo. I, I said, I'm so grateful, daughter Kamaya. I'm so grateful. Hallelujah. Listen, last week, two weeks ago, I should have died. Y'all not going to talk back to me tonight, but I'm going to keep on talking. Hallelujah. I'm so grateful. Mm, hallelujah. Come on here. I, I said, I'm so grateful. Woo. I ain't supposed to be here, but I'm here. I'm grateful. I am so grateful. God bless you. Amen. Sister Alanda. Hallelujah. Sister Adrian. Amen. She planted her seed early. Glory to God. God bless you, Sister Adrian. May the Lord bless your seed. Hallelujah. Even the more. Amen. May God increase you even the more. Thank you, Sister Latoya. Amen. There's the way the ways that you all can sow. Amen. And the seed amount tonight is 40. Amen. 40, 140, 440, 1,040. Make sure there's a 40 in your seed tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You know, Jesus said in his word, yes, Lord, I hear you. Jesus said in his word, he said, if I be lifted up from the earth, I will draw all men unto me. And I think that's where we messed up at church. I think we've messed up. Amen. Because we don't, we don't lift up the name of Jesus anymore. Hallelujah. Let me just slow walk this. Cause I hear God saying, amen to, to just stay right here. Listen, I think we messed up. I think we, we have forsaken the sovereignty of our Lord and Savior. <laughs> Some people are going to be mad at me, but I really don't care. A amen. Hallelujah. I believe that and that we, we've forgotten the sanctity, the sovereignty. Hallelujah. Of our Lord and Savior. Amen. I hear you singing, prophet. Amen. Flowing from my heart. Yeah. <laughs> See, I can stay right there. Hallelujah. But, but amen. We've forgotten the sanctity, the sovereignty, the holiness. Ah, the holiness of God. Mm. My God, the, the holiness. Hey, we're going to talk about being tried in the fire in just a minute. But leaders, pastors, apostles, bishops, ministers, evangelists, hallelujah, get back to lifting up the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Get, get back. Hallelujah. To calling God the holy God of Israel. The holy one. Mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. See, see we, we've got. Yes, Lord, I hear you. Mm. Woo. 
my God, tonight. Mm, he, he's holy. <laughs> he, he's righteous. <laughs> Hallelujah. Listen. Hey, Shanda Basoya. I said he's holy. He's righteous. Woo. Mm. 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 And, and when you think about his holiness, hey, whoo. Hallelujah. Listen, listen. When you think about, hallelujah, it's angels. Hiya, Bashanda Basoya. Yes, Lord, it's angels in my house. Hiya, Shanda Basoya. And daughter Kamaya, I see the angels. Woo, hallelujah. And I hear the angels crying, holy, 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 holy. Holy, 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 holy. <laughs> see, see, we forgotten that part. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. But the angels cry, holy, all day and night. Hallelujah, which there is no time in heaven. Hallelujah, but the angels, they cry holy, 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 holy. I know three of y'all with me tonight. The rest of everybody else, I'd have lost them. Hey, God, Shanda Basoya, because we're so caught up in our emotions and we forgot about the sanctity of God. We get so caught up. Hi, did it your shot. And what's next? That we forget about what he's already done. My God tonight. But when I think of the goodness of Jesus. <laughs> hallelujah. Listen, all it takes is a memory. Woo, hallelujah. Of where I used to be and what I used to do. Come on, somebody. We, we, don't, we don't say it because we're boasting and bragging that I don't used to do the things that I did before. But we say it to give God glory. To let somebody know that if he brought me out, he could bring you out. Hallelujah. But most of all, I'm in my right mind. Woo. Come on, somebody. Do, do you do you remember the times when you were not in your right mind? Do you remember the times, amen, when even your mind was turned over, amen, to the ways of the world and God is God was calling you and you was like, God, I'm coming. I just ain't coming just yet. Hallelujah. Come on. Does anybody remember the times when you was in the world, amen, and your cut buddies or your, your sisters, you know, your, your so-called best friend and your so-called girlfriends was trying to pull you every which way to do the thing that were contrary to the word of God. Amen. And then God's grace had to be on your life. And hallelujah. God had to listen. He had to shield you and protect you from bullets. Come on here. Hallelujah. He listen. He ah, oh, shun of us. So yeah. Hallelujah. He had to shield you and protect you. Amen. For what it could have, what could have killed you and took you out of here. Anybody, 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 anybody remember? It's all right. I remember. Whew. I remember on TikTok. TikTok, I remember. I remember. <laughs> Hallelujah. I re hey, I remember. And not only that, those that are still in the world that I used to be with. A and some are no longer here. But we're still here. Somebody shout, I'm still here. <laughs> Come on, somebody shout, I'm still here. Hallelujah. So, so that means there's more. Mm. Glory to God. Because you're still here, that means there's more. Hallelujah. That means there's more. Hallelujah. Not just blessings, but there's, there's more. Hallelujah. In store for you. Amen. There's more that God has for you. Hallelujah. And even for you to do. Glory to God. Hallelujah. That's why we thank God for deliverance. Amen. Everybody can't say that. I'm just saying, everybody can't say, amen, that they've been delivered. Woo. Hallelujah. But, but I thank God, amen, for deliverance. Amen. Twyla Bryant. She says, bless the Lord. I found you, Director Carmen Bryant Haywood. God bless you, Twyla. God bless you, Twyla, on TikTok. Glory to God. That ties into a word, Twyla. A prophet just told me recently that people were going to find me. Jesus have mercy. I'm nobody. I'm I'm just his vessel. Amen. I, I'm just I'm just I'm just his vessel. That's all. Hallelujah. Sold out. Mm. Glory to God. Hallelujah. The prophet just tell me that. <laughs> Glory to God. Hallelujah. Do, do you know? Amen. That when you serve God for real, for real. Amen. There are those that would never forget your ministry. They will never forget, amen, that the words that you have spoken over them and the prayers, hallelujah, that you pray, glory to God. And 
Hallelujah. People will never forget. You know, it's one thing. Yes, Lord, I hear you. It's one thing to say that you love a person. Amen. But but if you can, amen, come out of yourself and really, really, yes, Lord, I hear you. And really be there for that person outside of yourself, not in your strength, but in the strength of God. Mm. Hallelujah. And don't even want anything. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. But, but don't, oh, whew. don't even want anything. You just want God to get the glory. Do you know people will never forget you for that? Hallelujah. People will never, ever forget you. Amen. The, the good deeds that you do. Hallelujah. The, the things that you say that causes an impact in their life. Glory to God. It's some of you on here right now. I could call your names out. I'll never forget you. Amen. I'll, I'll never forget. Hallelujah. Amen. How many of you unselfishly, amen, encouraged me. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. I, I could call your names out. Hallelujah. But amen. God is saying even tonight that it's very important that you leave an impression. Amen. Upon the people that you come in contact with. And let it be a good impression. Amen. Let it let it be a good impression. I don't know who needs to hear this tonight, but amen. Even on TikTok, let, let it be a good impression. Hallelujah. Let, let it be one that, amen, they can say God is in you. Woo. Hallelujah. And, and that God is working through you. Come on here. And they heard God through you. Woo. Hallelujah. A amen. Come on, somebody. Because it's enough of having the title. Listen, titles don't mean nothing. Amen. If we're not really walking in who we say we are. Come on here. I need you all to like, tag, and share. Amen. Click that share button. Amen. Come on. Share this broadcast. Put it in somebody's messenger. Tag some people's names, if you will. Amen. On to the live tonight. Glory to God. Listen, we are on. I love you, Prophet. You know I do, Prophet Cornell. Amen. Hallelujah. He just ministered to me, y'all. I'm telling you. I got, I got everything I needed. <laughs> right over the phone. Hallelujah. The Prophet. Amen. Poured out, poured out, poured out the word of the Lord. Amen. To me and brought great confirmation hallelujah amen we're going to shift amen and we're going to move forward on tonight amen let us pray father in the name of jesus oh god we thank you father for this opportunity to gather together in your presence tonight lord we say thank you lord we thank you for this day that you granted us god a day that we'll never see before father but we thank you for keeping us all the day long father we repent of our sins oh god any sins we've committed anything we've done father please forgive us wash us clean purify our hearts tonight purify our minds tonight oh god wash our hands clean once again father in the mighty name of jesus yes lord and we repent in your presence god whatever we've done father whether it was last year last week last month even yesterday that we did not repent for father please forgive us in the mighty name of jesus god lord continue hallelujah to be lord of our life continue lord to lead and guide us into all truth by your holy spirit father we thank you tonight even for your power and your anointing we thank you, Lord God, even for this word that's going to be ministered unto your people, Lord. Thank you for even moving mightily by your spirit on tonight, oh God. We thank you for each and every listener, Father, of the word tonight. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, God, open up the ears of your people tonight that they would hear what you're saying unto their spirit, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus. And God, we thank you. And Lord, we praise you. Lord, I thank you for every platform tonight. I thank you for Instagram. I thank you for Facebook. I thank you for TikTok. Lord God, I even thank you, Father, even for YouTube tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus, bless your people, I pray. Hallelujah. Heal your people, I pray tonight, oh God. In the mighty name of Jesus, God, set the captive free. Hey, Shanda Basoya, set the captive free tonight. Those who are bound, Lord God, set them free by your word tonight, Father. Encourage the one that needs to be encouraged tonight. Encourage the encourager tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, touch your prophets, I pray. Oh, God, touch your pastors, your apostles. Hallelujah. In the mighty name of Jesus, God, your evangelists, my God, even your prophets. Yes, Lord, touch the fivefold ministry tonight, Father. In a special way, I pray in the name of Jesus. I, oh, God, do something special for your leaders tonight, oh, God. In the mighty name of Jesus, encourage their hearts, Father. Oh, God, that they will run on to 
see what the end is going to be. And Lord, encourage that person. Oh my God, that is going through tonight, Father. Encourage that person, Lord God, that feels like they're in a dark place. Oh God, shine your light tonight by releasing your word into their spirit, oh God. Shine your light tonight. Hallelujah. And be the light in their dark situation, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus. And Lord, send forth your hope tonight, God. Oh God, because you are hope, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus, that person that feels hopeless. Oh God, give them hope. Hallelujah. To tie a knot and hold on to their faithful God. In the mighty name of Jesus. And Lord, we thank you for it now. Oh God, we praise you for it now. Thank you for this here, your people, Lord God. And thank you for this time, Lord God. Mm that you have granted unto us. Oh God, for many are leaving here early, but God, we thank you right now for life. Oh God, we thank you for health. We thank you for strength tonight, my God. In the mighty name of Jesus, God, strengthen us like never before. Oh Father, in the name of Jesus, yes, Lord, and help us to run this race with patience. Oh, the race that is set before us, oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh God, and help us to repent, Lord, and help us to turn Turn, oh God, hallelujah, from our evil, wicked ways, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh God, send forth your conviction tonight by your Holy Spirit, oh God, in the name of Jesus, yes, Lord, even as you convicted me many years ago, God, oh God, send forth your conviction power tonight in the mighty name of Jesus that somebody, hallelujah, will cry out, what must I do to be saved? That somebody will repent tonight. Oh God, in the name of Jesus, um, that somebody will come clean again uh, before your presence, oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus. God, somebody needs you tonight. Um, somebody needs your power, Lord, to continue to stand. Uh, somebody needs your grace tonight, God, for your grace is sufficient uh, in the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, somebody needs a release tonight. Uh, oh God, but help them, oh God, to be able to release what it is that they have to release, God, so that they can receive receive the release from you, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus, somebody, hey, Shanda Basoya, yes, God. Somebody needs another touch. Oh, God, touch them right now, Father. From the crown of their head to the sole of their feet. Oh, God, touch that person that needs deliverance tonight. Oh, God, purge them and set them free, I pray. In the mighty name of Jesus. And Lord, that person tonight. Oh, God, that's ready to give up, Father. Help them right now to tie a knot and hold on to their faith, oh, God. In the name of Jesus, not to give up, but to continue to run this race. In the mighty name of Jesus. And Lord, we thank you for it now. We praise you for it now, oh God. Release your anointing, I pray, even upon TikTok, YouTube, oh God, Instagram and Facebook Live, every, oh God, platform tonight, Father. Breathe upon your people, I pray, in the name of Jesus. And Lord, have your way tonight. Oh God, sweep through the broadcast tonight, oh God. Oh God, minister to the hearts of your people like never before. Change somebody tonight, God. Hey, shine change them oh God hallelujah from the inside out not from the outside in but God go way deep tonight oh God and touch the hearts of your people I pray in the mighty name of Jesus and God help us to be like David where David said create in me a clean heart oh God and renew within me the right spirit Lord we thank you tonight that somebody's gonna cry out Lord create in me a clean heart and renew Renew within me the right spirit. Uh, Lord, we thank you tonight for your power and your anointing. Uh, move how you want to move, God. Speak how you want to speak, Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus. Um, and Lord, those who have come hungry and ready. Oh, God, fill them up till they want no more. Oh, God, feed your people tonight. Um, in the mighty name of Jesus. Woo. Yes, Lord. And it's in Jesus' mighty name I do pray. Amen. Amen. And amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Listen, this word, amen, has been in my spirit for the last three days. Those of you on Instagram, stay right there. TikTok, stay right there. Facebook, stay right there. God bless you, Brother Dan. Amen. YouTube, stay right there. Listen, three whole days and I couldn't shake it no more. Amen, Sister Nakresha. I was like, okay, God, I hear you. And he kept speaking to me. He said, tried in the fire, Woo. but you're coming out with the victory. 
He said, many of my people have been tried in the fire, <laughs> but you're coming out with the victory. Listen, and the seed amount is 40. Let me give it to you all early because you know y'all like to eat and run. Some of y'all need to sow right now, even before the word goes forth. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because you need to come out now. Be because there's more, you got to come out. It's time for you to win. <laughs> Hallelujah. Listen, some of you are tired and you're sick and tired of being sick and tired of being sick and tired. But be so sick and tired that tonight you do something different. Be so sick and tired tonight that you say, you know what? I'm coming out of my flesh. I'm coming out of carnality. I'm coming out of this thinking, thinking. And I'm going to listen and obey God. I got to come out now. My life depends on me coming out. Woo. My children's life depends on me coming out. My family, hallelujah, is depending on me to come out. I got to come out now. Hey, I don't have a choice any longer. Hallelujah. See, some of you, amen, you're playing it safe because you're like, you know what? I know I need to come out, but I ain't willing to sacrifice. I ain't willing to go through. I'm just going to stay in the fire. Woo. God is saying, no, 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 no. You've already been tried in the fire. Some of you, your faith has already been tested. Mm. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We're going to turn to the scriptures in just a minute. Some of you, amen, you just like the children of Israel. You've been, in, you've been in the wilderness for 40 years. Some of you 10 years. Some of you five years. Some of you two years. <laughs> some of you been in the wilderness for the last six months. Are you tired? Are you tired? Because see, now you got to do something different. Hallelujah. N now you got to be the one, even in your family, woo, that, that raises the standard, that raises the bar and say, listen, we're not going to stay in this generational curse. I am the curse breaker, which means, yes, I'm in the fire, but I'm not going to stay in there always. I'm not going to stay, hallelujah, in the fire all because of negligence. Woo, Shanda Basoya. I'm not going to stay in the fire all because I've gotten comfortable in the fire. If God is saying you've been tried in the fire, mm, hallelujah, but, but, but you got to come out now. Because victory is right in front of you. Sometimes we get complacent. I know I'm talking to some of y'all. See, see, you want God to preach you out of it, but God is saying, I'm giving you strength to come out of it. Come on here. Hallelujah. See, 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 you sometimes we make it hard for the preacher. We make it hard for the pastor. We make it hard for the, for the vessel. Amen. Listen, sometimes we want to be preached into a frenzy. Come on here. Sometimes, oh, y'all not going to talk back to me tonight, but I'm going to keep on talking. Sometimes we want the prophet to prophesy to us and tell us wonderful things so we can have enough strength to come out. But God is saying, are you tired? I've already tested you in the fire. Woo. Hallelujah. And I don't know about anybody else, but when there's a test, you get a grade. Hallelujah. When I was in school, Sister Jada, amen, I wanted to know my grade before I got home. So sometimes after the test, I would go up to the teacher's desk and I would say, what, what was my grade? What did I get, teacher? And sometimes the teacher would give it to me, Sister Cynthia Marie, sometimes the teacher would just, you know, would take my paper and, and grade it real quick and say, and just show me my grade. Hallelujah. I don't know about anybody else. Glory to God. But, but I need to know my grade. Hallelujah. Because there's some promises that are in front of me and I got to make sure, hallelujah, that I get a good enough grade or I've graded to the point to where I've passed. Oh, see, see, see. <laughs> Hallelujah. Come on, Brother Antonio. We trying to pass now. I don't know about nobody else. You can stay where you at. I'm not trying to stay <laughs> in my last season. Hiya. Shanda Basoya. Listen, the prophet told me before I got on live that I passed it, that I passed. So God gave me my confirmation before I ministered to you all. God already told me that I passed. Hallelujah. I'm getting ready to be ushered into my next season. Glory to God. And I thank God for it. But it's good to know where you are in the realm of the spirit. <laughs> it is good to know. Hallelujah. That as your faith was tested. Did you pass it? Did, 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 did you trust God? Oh, are you still trusting God? Mm. Come on here. 
Hallelujah. But because see the children of Israel, they came out 40 years later. Something that could have took a shorter distance and a shorter time took 40 years. Hallelujah. They, they could have come out of the wilderness, but they decided to continue to complain. Come on. They decided to mumble and grumble and be ungrateful. See, see, some of you, you're going to understand that your grave may not be where it should be, but you're going to thank God tonight that you've been tried in the fire and you're coming out with the victory. It is good to know, Prophetess Cassandra, your grave. <laughs> Hallelujah. And sometimes we may feel Instagram, amen, Instagram, Facebook, um, TikTok, YouTube. We, we may feel like we didn't pass. But then God says, no, you passed. You passed. Hallelujah. You passed. Glory to God. You might not have gotten the grade that you desired because you knew it was more that you should have done. But you passed. Hallelujah. And the creature says, I'm ready for my new season. Come on here. Hallelujah. There's some of you that have been in the wilderness. You've been in a dark place and you know you've been in a dark place. Hallelujah. Sister Kamaya says, wow, this is how I have been feeling. We thank God for confirmation. I'm telling you, I've been holding this word for three days. I'm not a prophet that just gets on Facebook because I don't have nothing else to do. No, I'm not a prophet that just gets on TikTok because I don't have nothing else to do. I have to wait until the unction of the Holy Spirit. I got to wait, hallelujah, until God tells me when to release his word. Glory to God. And so Joshua 5 and 6. Glory to God. Joshua 5 and 6. Matter of fact, I'm going to read down just a little bit. Glory to God. Mm -mm -mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God bless you all on TikTok. Come on, send up some hearts. Amen. Come on, send up some hearts. Send up some gifts on TikTok. I know this is a little different TikTok. Y'all can hear me, but you can't see me. Amen. Y'all can hear me, but you can't see me. Come on, TikTok. Hit some hearts. Hit some hearts. Send up some gifts. Amen. Help us meet our goal tonight. Amen. The goal should be set there on TikTok. Amen. Help us meet that goal tonight in Jesus' name. Amen. Joshua 5 and 6. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord, I hear you. Glory to God. Listen, some of you, thank you, Holy Spirit. I hear you, God. Yes, Lord. Some of you, you're going to be looking for your prophet and you're not going to be able to get a hold of your prophet. Some of you, yes, Lord, I hear you. Some of you have mishandled your prophet. And God has been speaking to you and give you word and word and word after word. Amen. Through your prophet, but you have not obeyed. Uh-oh, we shifting right here. God says, hear the word of your prophet and run with it. I may not be your prophet. I hear God saying some of you have, have a prophet. You, you are in the presence of your prophet and you choose not to hear the word of the Lord through your prophet. God is saying the time is going to come. You can write this word down and take it to the bank. <laughs> The time is going to come where some of you, you're going to, you're going to try to reach out to your prophet and your prophet is not going to be available. God is shifting the prophets. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We're shifting right here. Stay with me. We're going to read Joshua in a minute. God is shifting the prophets. God, yes, Lord. Hallelujah. God is doing something within his prophets. He's, he's also taking his prophets to different regions and territories. So you may look up and try to get in touch with your prophet and your prophet may not be available. God says, hold on to the word that your prophet has given you. It's quiet. <laughs> Y'all looking at me like I'm crazy. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. I'm going to say it again. It's going to happen. Thank you, Lord. He says, and don't get comfortable with your prophet. Don't get comfortable with the prophets. See, the viewers are dropping. You know why? Because we slowed down a little bit. 
P people don't people don't like they don't they 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 like the hype. But see, this is what you need to hear right here. Because God is saying his prophet has spoken to you, but did you adhere to the word? Mm, the words, I hear word and words. Some of you got a word from your prophet. Some of you got words, multiple words from your prophet, and you still did not obey. Uh-oh. 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 He says, go back and obey. Go back and walk in obedience. Go back. Hallelujah. Go back. Go back. Amen. And Anthony Jones says, rebuke me, Lord. That's an honest comment right there. That's an honest comment right there. Hmm. Yes, Lord. He says, go back. Go back to the word that your prophet gave you. And walk in obedience now. It's going to save your life. And God says, then you will be able to go forward. Hmm. Kaya Shanda Basoya. Yes, Lord. Then you will be able to go forward. Shavanda says, don't miss it. Mm. There's some, yes, Lord. There's some of you see the viewers are dropping. People don't like this. They don't like this. They don't like this. But, but this is needed because half of you that are watching and can hear me clearly, this is what you need. Even before we start reading Joshua, even before we get into 1 Corinthians, and then before we start reading 1 Peter. Glory to God. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. He says in some of you, the word is coming back now. The word that the prophet spoke to you is coming back now. See, the enemy's job Mm. I want to help about 12 of y'all. The enemy's job is to rob you from the word. The Bible says in John 10 and 10, the thief cometh not but to kill and to steal and to destroy. Any, any way that he can kill, steal and destroy, he's going to do it. If he, yes, Lord. If he can steal the word from you, he will. Because he knows if he steals the word, that he can also tamper with the promise. Jesus, have mercy. And many of you, you're waiting for the promise. You're waiting for the blessing. You're waiting for the manifestation to come of what God said. But you got to be obedient even in the process to get to the promise. See, we shifting right here. Hallelujah. Be because before God, hallelujah, remind you tonight that you've been tried in the fire, but you're coming out with the victory. See, this is a celebratory word. This, this, this right here, Minister Derek and, and Sister Lene and Brother Antonio and amen, Brother Dan, hallelujah, and, and, and Prophetess Cassandra, hallelujah, those of you, amen, and Sister Kamaya, glory to God, those that are hearing the word of the Lord, amen, Prophet Cornell, listen, those that are really listening to the word of the Lord, before you can start celebrating, whew, See, because this word, amen, this is a coming out word, coming out I got to break this thing down. Hallelujah. I need two intercessors praying for me right here because this is heavy. Hey, glory to God, because I feel a yoke being destroyed in the realm of the spirit. Hallelujah. Sister Stacy. I feel a yoke that is getting ready to be destroyed in the realm of the spirit. And this is the yoke. Hallelujah. That was around some of you's neck. Woo. Glory to God. That is the yoke of bondage. And some of you have been asking, you've been saying, God, why does it feel like I'm in bondage? Why does it feel like I'm bound by something? Huh? Why does it feel like something is, is pulling me back when I'm trying to go forward and I'm trying to be about my father's business and I'm trying hallelujah, to be obedient to God, but something is pulling me back. I feel like I'm in bondage somewhere. Woo. 
Glory to God. This is your message right here, right now. This is it right here, right now. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hey, God says, before I can have you to celebrate, I have to remind you, glory to God, hallelujah, that you now have to be obedient. Woo! Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. You, hey, Shanda Basoya. There it is. Glory to God. I just felt the yoke be destroyed in the spirit. Hallelujah. And we thank God for it. Hallelujah. Sister Cynthia Marie. Amen. You're no longer going to be in the place that you're in. Hallelujah. Because the yoke has just been destroyed. Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. The yoke has just been destroyed. The yoke of bondage. Oh, my God. The yoke. Shanda Basoya. Even of the generational curse my god some of you been feeling like you're replaying some of your family's history you, you're replaying even the spirit of disobedience oh god hallelujah some of you even feel like that's right and then nia says yes i feel like i'm stuck listen before we can celebrate that we're coming out we got to make sure that we understand. You know, the Bible says after getting all, get an understanding. So, so we got to get an understanding now. And God has given you an understanding. He, he's, he's showing you in the realm of the spirit what was causing even the delay and, and what was causing even the disobedience, hallelujah, that kept you in the yoke of bondage, that kept, my God, that kept you in bondage to make you feel like you wasn't going to make it. Some of you, you thought it was witchcraft. God says, no, it was disobedience. But the Bible does say rebellion is as the sin of witchcraft. So, so when you're rebellious against the word that is coming through the mouth of the prophet, that is witchcraft. But witchcraft was not put on you. Some of you feel like witchcraft was put on you. And lately you've been saying it like, is somebody putting witchcraft on me? No, you were just disobedient. That's all. That's all. That's all. There, there was just disobedience. Come on here. Hallelujah. If God tells you to go left, go left. If God tells you to go up, go up. If God tells you to go down, go down. God even told the He even told Jeremiah, He said, go down to the potter's house. Hallelujah. There comes a time where you got to go exactly where, oh, mm. Mm. in order to get what you need from the Lord. See, Jeremiah needed to go down to the potter's house. He, he needed, hey, Shanda Basoya. He needed to be on the potter's will, but he had to see what the potter was doing first. He said, he said, Jeremiah, look and see as, as, as I am, as I am molding this clay on the wheel, I'm going to do the same thing with you, Jeremiah. Mm. Hallelujah. I, I'm going to do the same thing with you. But see, he had to go down. <laughs> Hallelujah. He, he had to go down, Brother Antonio. And sometimes we don't want to go down. So sometimes we don't want to humble ourselves. Woo! Hallelujah. But how many of you know that's the best place to be in? Hey! Because see, on the mountain is when we rejoice. On the mountain is the victory. Hallelujah. See, see, that's when we celebrate the victory when we're on the mountain. But it's really in the valley that we learn him. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Even, even God spoke to Ezekiel in the valley. <laughs> He said, Ezekiel, I know, I know, I know you're, you're in the valley with the dry bones and you wondering how you got here. Hey, <laughs> hallelujah. Glory to God. And God began to speak to Ezekiel. And what did he tell him, Kiva? He, he said, listen, listen, I need you to prophesy to these bones, Ezekiel. Hey, can these bones live? Speak to the bones in the valley. Speak. Oh, my God. Hallelujah. And some of you, that was your word. Where you are, speak to your situation. No, you were just waiting for your situation to change. But God spoke through the prophet and told some of you, see, that was your word. Some of you, your word was speak to your situation. 
Some of you, oh, y'all getting it now. You're getting it now. Hallelujah. But the fact that you just waited for it to get better and you didn't speak to it, that still was disobedience. I'm helping about five of y'all out right here. Hallelujah. It just feels very uncomfortable being in a low place. Yes, it does, Nina. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But, but we got to embrace the low place. Because the Bible says in due time, God will exalt you. Hey. And, and you know, promotion comes from the Lord, not from man. Come on. It's in the low place that we're being made. It's in, it's in the low place that we're learning God. It's in the low place <laughs> that we can still worship him. It's in the low place that we still pray. Come on here. When we celebrate on the mountain, we celebrate the victories when he gets us to the place of elevation and promotion. But we can't ask God to promote us and we don't celebrate in the valley. Come on here. Or, or better yet, we don't go through our process in the valley. I hear God saying that some of you skip some steps. Hallelujah. So some of you skip some steps. Whew. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. And in the midst of you skipping the steps, he says, it's okay. Because now you realize what it is that you have to do. You know, I tell the prophets that I mentor all the time. Every word is not for everybody. But do you all just see how God just came on in and gave many of you what you needed? Hallelujah. Before, amen, the word of celebration. See, prophets, we, yes, Lord. Mm -hmm. Prophets, we have to be so keen in the spirit. That we don't get just overexcited about, let me just release this word and let me just, you know, bless the people. And let me just, because sometimes a rebuke is a blessing. Sometimes being rebuked and chastised, that's a great blessing. You know, the Bible says God chastises those whom he loves. It's 1219. I got to get ready to get out of here. It's getting late. God chastises those whom he loves. YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. Amen. Blessings to your daughter, Chanel. Amen. She's, she's kicked off of Facebook, y'all. Prophet Chanel is off of Facebook. They done kicked her off to the 20th. Amen. But she found a way, amen, to connect with the ministry. So she's on TikTok tonight. God bless you, Prophet Chanel. Hallelujah. Amen. So, so let's read. Y'all got it? Y'all got it? Did y'all get it? Did y'all get it? If, if y'all got it, just hit the heart for Jesus. Amen. If y'all got it for real, y'all got it? Did y'all get it? Did y'all get it? Y'all got it? Y'all got it? Yeah. 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 Did, did y'all get it on TikTok? Y'all got it? Hmm. My Lord. All right. Let's, let's move forward. Hallelujah. I feel even a weight has been lifted. Glory to God. Y'all got it? Okay. Okay. Amen. 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 Joshua chapter five, verse six. Amen. And it reads for the children of Israel walked 40 years in the wilderness until all the people that were men of war, which came out of Egypt, came out of where? Out of Egypt. All right. Were consumed because they obeyed not the voice of the Lord. See that? Unto, unto whom the Lord swore that he would not show them the land which the Lord swore um, unto them, unto their fathers, that he would give us, which was a land that was flowing with milk and honey. Amen. Verse seven, and their children whom he raised up in their stead, them Joshua circumcised, for they were uncircumcised because they had not circumcised them by the way. Verse eight, and it came to pass when they had done circumcising all the people that they abode in their places in the camp until they were healed. Verse nine, and the Lord said unto Joshua, this day have I rolled away the, repro the reproach, which is the rebuke of Egypt from off of you. Sounds like freedom to me. 
I'm going to read that again, verse 9. So this is Joshua 5 and 9. All right. He says, and the Lord answered Joshua and said, the day has now rolled away the, re the, repro the reproach of Egypt from off of you. It's no longer on you. The rebuke is no longer on you. He says, wherefore, the name of the place is called Gilgal unto this day. Amen. And I have read Joshua 5, 6 through 9. And this was after the children of Israel had come out of the wilderness for 40 years. Amen. So, so after you have been tried, after you have gone through, there is a coming out. And this is what happened for the children of Israel. Let's turn to 1 Corinthians um, 3 and 13. 1 Corinthians 3 and 13. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 1 Corinthians 3 and 13. Yes, Lord, I hear you. God says some of you are even being healed by the word tonight. You're being healed by the word. Just hearing the word is bringing healing to many of you. <sighs> mm. Glory to God. 1 Corinthians 3 and 13. And it reads, every man's work shall be made manifest for the day shall declare it because it shall be revealed by fire and the fire shall try every man's work of what sort it is. Mm. Let's read verse 14. And if any man's work abides, which he has built therefore upon, he shall receive a reward. Mm. Let's read, let's read 15. And if any man's work shall be burned, he shall suffer loss. Uh-oh. And he himself shall be saved, yet so as by fire. Every person's work is going to be tried by fire. My work, your work. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. What you do for the Lord is going to be tried by fire. First Corinthians 3 and 13, it talks about our work being tried by fire. For as it's being tested, we're going to come out with the victory based upon the fact that we've done the work that God has called us to do. It's coming back to me again. Some of you skip steps. You got to go back and do what God is saying to do. Some of you need to go back and do your first works all over again. Mm. You, you got you to go. Uh, I'll wait. I'll wait. <laughs> I'll wait. I'll wait. Those of you that know you need to go back and do your first works, you know who you are. I don't have to call your name out. I don't I don't even have to say anything directly to you. Yeah. Yeah. Just go back and do it. Start all over again. Hallelujah. S start all over again. Hallelujah. It, yes, Lord. He says this even applies to you being in the fire, tried in the fire. But you're coming out with the victory. This is your victory. That God has given you another opportunity to start again. Mm. Somebody going to catch it in the morning. <laughs> if you're not catching it now, you, you're going to catch it. You, you will catch it in the morning. Hallelujah. Wait a minute, God. You, you, you're giving me another chance. So by me being tried in the fire, I've come out with the victory. And the victory is that you're giving me an opportunity to start all over again. Yes. That's amazing. You, you know why that's amazing, church? Because some people don't get an opportunity to start all over again. Some people miss the mark and never get an opportunity to come back and do it all over again. They just keep on going and keep on going and keep on going and keep on going like everything is okay. But God said, this is your moment of victory. 
because now you're going to be able to begin again. Hallelujah. You're going to be you're going to be able to begin again. Oh, this is good. We talk about new beginnings. We talk about, you know, eight being the number of, of new beginnings. And we just came out of the eighth month going into the ninth month. And we talk about birthing. Right. And we're saying that God is birthing out something new in us and he's doing something new in us. Well, the truth of the matter is this. If you didn't let God kill what was old, let him kill what was dead, then nothing new can birth. And sometimes, yes, Lord, sometimes you got to let go of the old and you got to let go of what was stay dead so that you can walk in the new. Amen. And bring birth to something new. Oh, this is powerful. This is powerful. This is powerful. I hope I'm not losing nobody. Amen. This, this is so powerful because God is giving you an opportunity. Come on, TikTok. Y'all not hitting them hearts. Come on. Let me hit some hearts. Come on here. Y'all not hitting the hearts. TikTok. Y'all just listening. Come on, send up some gifts. Come on here. Hallelujah. <laughs> TikTok, y'all. Y'all need to come on. Come on, TikTok. Hallelujah. So, amen. 1 Peter 1 and 7. It says, amen. And this talks about the trial of your faith. All right. It talks about the trial of your faith because many of you, your, your faith has been tested. Can you be honest? Can you be honest? Amen. Can, can we get some honesty tonight? That your faith has been tested. Come on. It says that the trial of your faith, which um, being much more precious than gold, that perisheth. Uh-huh. Which means that dies and, and withers away. Though it be tried in the fire, it might be found unto praise and honor and glory at the appearing of Jesus Christ. I'm going to read that again. Verse 7. That the trial of your faith, the testing of your faith brings forth much precious, more precious than gold, that gold perishes away. Though it be tried through the fire, might be found unto praise and honor and glory at the appearing of Jesus Christ. That sounds like the end. So, so, so what the word is saying is that your, your faith has been tested and that your faith had to go through the fire. Anybody grateful that your faith was tested? You know, some people say that God doesn't test us. Yes, he does. The Bible says in the book of James, the trying of your faith work and patience, but let patience have a perfect work. That you may be entirely wanting nothing. See, I'm losing some people. I'm losing some people. The numbers are dropping. You know why? Because people don't want sound doctrine. This is sound doctrine. This word right here is going to have you to do one or two things. Repent and ask God for forgiveness. And thank him for a new beginning to start over. Or... You get to a place of celebration because you passed the test. And you say, Lord, I thank you for the victory. But either way, it's still a victory. Hallelujah. E either way, amen, this is still a win-win. No matter which side you find yourself in this word. <laughs> YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. It is still a win-win. Amen. Prophet Cassandra said, this word save is saving my life. Hallelujah, if I read correctly. Hold on, this word will save your life. Amen. Amen. Glory to God. So, so, so you're winning either way. Amen. You're winning either way because your faith has been tested and you now have the victory and you've gotten to the end of the wilderness. I wait. <laughs> I wait. I, I just need somebody to just shout amen on that right there. You, who Shanda Basoya. How, listen, your wilderness season is over. Okay. Okay. <laughs> you ain't going to cry over that no more. Whew. See, the saints going to come back on strong, y'all. We're going to go up to 30 viewers real quick. Watch this. Watch this. <laughs> Hallelujah. Glory to God. Listen, you're not going. <laughs> you're not going to go through that again. 
It's over, Sister Alanda. It's over, Sister Stacy. Listen, you, you have gone through it. You can write the book now. <laughs> you can write the devotion now. Listen, hallelujah. You can preach this message now. Come on, somebody. I've been tried in the fire. Woo, Shanda Basoya. But I came out with the victory in my hand. I've been tried. Hallelujah. Y'all see that celebration? Y'all see it, right? Boom. You see that? <laughs> Hallelujah. Facebook just gave us the celebration emoji. It just, listen, fireworks just went up. Hey, glory to God, which means, hallelujah, that we are now out, but we've come out with the victory. Oh, hallelujah. We have come out, Sister Stacy, with the victory. See, this is a right now word for many of you. This is a celebratory word. This is a word that's going to have you to celebrate your win. Oh. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Listen, you're going to celebrate your win. W-I-N, which means you're going to witness it now. Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. Which means your troublesome days are over. Mm, glory. Hallelujah. The Bible says weeping may endure for a night, but joy comes in the morning. Hallelujah. And it's morning time. Why? Because you got the victory now. It's morning time. Hallelujah. And you're going to witness your, your victory. You're going to witness, hallelujah, the promise. You're getting ready to win, hallelujah, which means you're going to witness it now. Hallelujah, not next week, not tomorrow, amen, but right now. Hallelujah, you're winning right now because you have the victory. Woo, glory, 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 glory. Hallelujah, yes, I see it's two Stacys. I'm talking to both of you. Glory to God, you're going to witness it now. I've been tried in the fire. Mm, hey, I've been tried in the fire. Hey, I've been tried in the fire. Hallelujah, but I got the victory. Come on, somebody, you been tried in the fire. Amen. But you're coming out with the victory. Come on, somebody. I want you to shout in your atmosphere. I'm coming out with the victory in my hand. I got the victory and it's in my hand. Hallelujah. I got the victory and it's in my hand. Hallelujah. I got the victory and it's in my hand. I have come out and I came out tonight. Hallelujah. But I'm reminded of the fire I had to go through. I'm reminded of the adversity I had to go through. I'm reminded of all of those, hallelujah, that said I wouldn't make it. I'm reminded, hallelujah, of people who said, why are you going to do it like that? Um, hallelujah, but you still did it. Hallelujah, and now you got graded. Hallelujah, and now your grade is an A. Hallelujah, and some of you are A++. Um, hallelujah, because you've been tried in the fire. Oh my God, you said I'm not going to give up because I'm in the testing season. I'm not going to give up because I'm being tested. Oh my God, but in the midst of the test, I'm, I passed the test. Who am I preaching to on tonight? I passed the test. I'm, hallelujah. And now I'm coming out. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. But I'm coming out with the victory in my hand. Hey, do you see what's in my hand? Hey, hallelujah. Do you see what's in my hand? hand. Hallelujah. It's victory. Hey, that's my new name. Glory to God. My new name is victory. Hey, Shanda Basoya. And because I got the victory, I got the power in the anointing now. Hallelujah. To bring some other people out. Glory to God. God says after I bring you out, I want you to go back and restore your brother. Oh, yes, Lord. Hallelujah. He says after I brought you out, I need you to go and get your sister. Hallelujah. And get your brother. Ah, yes, Lord, and restore them. Oh, my God. Hallelujah. And tell them they got the victory, too. Glory to God. Hey, Shanda Basoya. Hallelujah. And it's just like the three Hebrew boys. Glory to God. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. Hallelujah. They were tried in the fire. Oh, my God. And the Bible, the Bible, the Bible says, hallelujah, that the heat was turned up times seven. I don't know who feels like. Glory to God. The heat has been turned up in your life. But I tell you, as God's prophet this early morning, hallelujah, that you've been tried in the fire. 
time, but you're coming out with the victory in your hand. And one thing I know about the three Hebrew boys, glory to God, they refused to bow down to the wicked king. They refused to bow down to Nebuchadnezzar. I'm almost done. Ah, yes, Lord. Hallelujah. They refused, glory to God, to give in. Hallelujah to the wicked king, Nebuchadnezzar. Oh, they said, why don't you, he said, why don't you bow down um, to me? Glory to God. And that's when the three Hebrew boys said, no, we refuse to bow down to you. Uh, we know the true and living God. Uh, yes, Lord. Hallelujah. And the Bible says, um, hallelujah, glory to God, that as, amen, the guards threw Nebuchadnezzar, they threw um, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego in to the fiery furnace and turned it up times seven. Uh, oh my God. That's when the guards began to look. Um, and they said, wait a minute, we threw in three, but there's a fourth man. Hey! Hallelujah. Glory to God. There's a fourth man. Ah, oh, and he looks like the son of God. How many of you know? Hallelujah. Sister Lucretia, brother Antonio, sister Lene. Hallelujah. Oh God. Hallelujah. Those of you that received this word. How many of you know both Stacy's tonight? Hallelujah. How many of you know that Jesus was in the fire with you? Oh my God. He was just waiting for the moment of your coming out. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. How do you know Jesus was in the fire with Come on, Bishop Whitfield. We know that Jesus was in the fire because we ain't lose our mind. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. We didn't lose all our stuff. Um, we lost something, but we didn't lose everything. Uh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. For the devil tried, but it didn't work. Uh, and I know the devil tried to take our stuff and take our mind and even take our joy and our peace. Uh, but God let us keep a little bit of it, Prophetess Cassandra. Hallelujah. So that we would stay in our right mind. So that we would still give God praise. Um, so that that we would still bless his holy name in the midst of the affliction. My God, in the midst of the adversity. Oh, yes, Lord, in the midst of the fire. And I don't know about anybody else. Uh, hallelujah. But I felt like I was in the fire just three months ago. Uh, oh, my God, when I had to make some decisions. Uh, hallelujah. To shut down the church. Um, I said, Lord, uh, I, I sound like Job. Uh, Though you slay me, yet will I trust you. Um, and how many of you know three months later? Oh, God of us not having a building, Sister Alanda. Hallelujah. The Lord just blessed us. Uh, glory to God with a new place of worship. Uh, see, sometimes, yes, Lord. See, I can preach this message the way I preach it because I've been in the fire. Yes, God. Hey! Hallelujah. I can preach it like this under the anointing. Hallelujah. You know why? Glory to God, because I've been in the fire, but God brought me out. He said, and daughter, as I brought you out of the fire, he said, as I brought you out, and I, oh God, even of your testing, my God, he said, now I need you to bring my people out. Yes, Lord. So I speak as God's prophet that now you are coming out. Oh, you're coming out is today. Yes, Lord. You can date it now. Hallelujah. Today is the day of my coming out. I know that I'm coming out because I feel the weights have been lifted. I feel the shackles have been destroyed. I'm no longer bound hand and foot. Come on, loser it, loser it. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Yes, Lord. Lazarus, my God. Hallelujah. Lazarus was bound up. He was bound hand and foot. My God. And how many of you know Jesus came to set him free? He said, I I am the resurrection. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. And Lazarus was no longer bound. Oh, God is setting somebody free tonight. Hallelujah. He said, I come to set you free. Oh, he said, I come to set you free tonight. Yes, Lord. God is setting you free. And this is your coming out day. Oh, my God. Somebody, you need to shout in your atmosphere. I'm coming out, but I got the victory in my hand. I'm no longer bound, no longer shackled. Yes, Lord. Lord. The chains have been destroyed um, off my mind and off my spirit. Uh, I can run now. Uh, hallelujah. As David said, I can run through a troop. Uh, I can leap over a wall. David said, I can do all things through Christ. Mm. Glory, 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 glory. <laughs> hallelujah. Yes, Lord Jesus. Uh, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Mm. God says, you've been tried in the fire. Woo! But you're coming out with the victory in your hand. 
<laughs> Hallelujah. See, if we was in church, I'd tell you put a praise on it. Hallelujah. But what I need you to do, Sister Diane, is give God a shout right where you are. Mm, hallelujah. Sister Tr Sister Stacy says, amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. I'm, she said, and I'm running real fast. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. And as I teach here in PIPW ministry, the devil can only hit a target that's staying still. Mm, hey. I'm running for my life. Hey, hey come on, somebody. <laughs> Hallelujah. I'm running for my life. Uh, glory to God. If anybody asks you, what's the matter with me? I uh, tell them I'm saved, sanctified. I'm, Hallelujah. Holy Ghost filled and I'm fire baptized. I, I got Jesus on my mind and I'm running for my life. I'm running, 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 running. Ah, glory to God. Hallelujah. I'm running. Yes, the Lord. And as I'm running, I'm praising him. As I'm running, I'm giving him glory. As I'm running, and I'm thanking him. Hallelujah. That God, you set us free. And Lord, we thank you tonight. God, we praise you tonight um, that we have been tried in the fire. Oh, but we got the victory in our hands uh, for we have come out this day. Hey, Shanda Basoya, we have come out this day with the victory in our hands. Hallelujah. Father, in the name of Jesus, oh God, we say thank you. Mm. We say thank you for this. Hear your word, oh God. Oh yes, Lord. Thank you for lifting her, Shanda Basoya, your people out of a pit tonight. Oh God, thank you even now, Father. Hallelujah, that you have blessed them abundantly. Thank you, Father God, that you have strengthened your people with this word. Thank you, Father, that they have come out, but they now have the victory. Yes, Lord. And Father, we thank you. Mm. Glory to God. We bless your holy name that we have come out, hallelujah, but we came out not even smelling like smoke. Oh, God, we thank you tonight. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Just like the three Hebrew boys. Oh, the Bible says, glory to God. Hallelujah. That even the hairs, hallelujah, that were singed, my God, didn't even have no smell. Even their clothes didn't smell like smoke. Father, we thank you now that what we had to endure, what we had to go through, oh, God, it gave us more patience. Um, hallelujah. It gave us more faith. Uh, Father, we thank you right now. Glory to God on this day. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. September. Hallelujah. The 10th. My God. Oh, Shanda Basoya. Yes, Lord. We thank you right now, Father. Um, oh, that this is the day that you have made. Uh, we shall rejoice and be glad in it. Uh, oh, God, we celebrate today. Um, hallelujah for our new beginning. Uh, we celebrate today even for the season of birthing. Uh, now, God, as you have brought us out, uh, you're going to birth something new in our lives. Uh, you're going to birth something new in our families. Uh, you're going to birth something new even in our ministries. Uh, God, we thank you now. Higher. Yes, Lord, we thank you right now, Father. Oh, God, for the 10th day. And God, we know 10 is the number of a new level. Oh, God, you're taking your people to a greater place. Oh, God, you're taking them to a new level in you, Father, in the realm of the spirit. Lord, we bless your name tonight, this early morning. And God, we say thank you. Thank you, Lord God, that we come out, but we come out with the victory in our hands. We have come out, hallelujah, not smelling like smoke, not even looking like our storm, not even looking like our situation, but God, we thank you. Oh, yes, Lord, that we got the victory. Hey, Shanda Basoya. Oh, Reka Tamanda Basoya da Basika da Maha. Oh, you did it, Oh, God, we celebrate today, and we say thank you, Father. Oh, God, that we don't look like what we've been through, but God, we look new. Hey, our hands look new. Uh, oh my God, our feet look new. Uh, yes, Lord. Uh, we can even see a new path. Um, we can even see a new vision. Uh, Father, we thank you now. Oh God, that our eyesight is clear uh, in the realm of the spirit. Uh, in the mighty name of Jesus, uh, we thank you now, God, even for new fire. Yes, Lord. Even for new wine tonight. My God, even for new oil. Yes, Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus. Uh, oh God, we thank you that the fire has come, even not to consume us or to burn us, but to purify us. Father, we thank you now mm, that we are purified. Oh, Shanda Basoya, and we're going to shine bright for you, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Mm. Hey, 
Haya di 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 osha, reka tamanda baso ya, ikana na mashandi di 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 osha. Yes, Lord Jesus, we thank you this early morning, God. We cannot praise you enough, but we know, Father, this day was written in heaven. Oh my God, that your people will be reminded that you have brought them out with the victory. Mm. Hey. Glory, 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 glory. And just as you promised the children of Israel that they shall go to the land mm, that is flowing with milk and honey. Father, we thank you now for your sons and your daughters that receive this word, that they shall eat the good of the land, that they shall see <laughs> the land that is flowing mm, with milk and honey God says get ready for the abundance hey get ready for the ayah bashanda basoya get ready for the overflow my God hallelujah he says I'm getting ready to release higher shanda basoya a blessing that you will not have room enough to receive it hey Oh, higher. He says, get your buckets. Higher did the old shot. He says, get your barrels. Huh? Oh my God. He says, because I'm getting ready to fill them. Hey. He says, not just one barrel. Ah, oh, Sister Stacy, not just one bucket. Huh? Oh my God. He said, but multiple. Ah, Shanda Basuya. He said, because you have endured hardship like a good soldier. He said, because as you were thrown in the fire, you endured. Huh? Hey, you now have the victory and you now have my blessing, save God. He says, reach your hands out and put your hands up to heaven and receive my abundant blessings oh for the faithful ones for my obedient vessels he said for my chosen vessels oh yes lord he says get ready for the outpour he says get ready for my shekinah glory he says get ready for fresh oil that is being poured even now oh my god upon your head upon your life and upon your ministry ah yes god he says hey shanda my he says, what I'm getting ready to do, you're not going to have room enough to receive it. You're going to have to give it away. You're going to have to give some. You're going to have to bless others. Oh my God, with what I'm getting ready to pour out in your life, all because you decided to be obedient, all because you decided to say yes, all because you decided to be faithful. Hey, Shanda Basoya, in the name of Jesus. So Lord, we thank you now. Hey. God, hallelujah, for the shift in the realm of the spirit. We thank you now, Father, mm, for your manifold blessings being released upon us now. We thank you, Father, ah, Shanda Basoya, that you are moving mightily by your spirit. We thank you now, Father, that, oh, God, even in the morning when we wake up, we're going to wake up to blessings. We're going to wake up to miracles. We're going to wake up, and everywhere we go, everywhere our feet, hallelujah, begins to tread and walk. Ah, oh, there's going to be blessing upon blessings and blessings in the name of Jesus, all oh, because of our obedience. So Father, we thank you now. Mm. Glory higher, Shanda Basoya. We thank you for the outpouring of your blessings. Oh God, in the name of Jesus, and we bless your holy name, Father. Oh God, that we've been tried in the fire, mm. but we have come out with the victory in our hands. And it's in Jesus' name that I do pray. Woo! And I seal this prayer in the blood of Jesus. I seal this word ah, in the blood of Jesus. And I count it done for God's people. And it's in Jesus' name that I do pray. Mm. Amen and amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. My assignment is done. Glory, glory, glory. I said my assignment is done. Amen. Those of you that received the word of the Lord and the impartation and the outpour tonight, you now have the opportunity to sow and to seal the word. It's your choice. Glory to God. The ministry's cash app is PIPW Ministry 2. Make sure that you put a 2 at the end. Glory to God. Dollar sign PIPW Ministry 2. Or you can sow dollar sign Prophetess Carmen 1. They both go to our ministry. 
Hallelujah. The ministry cash apps, once again, are PIPW Ministry 2. Make sure there's an orange flyer on that cash app. Glory to God. And then you have dollar sign Prophetess Carmen 1. The seed amount tonight is 40. Hallelujah. 40 is the coming out seed. Amen. You have come out, but you have come out with the victory in your hand. Hallelujah. There's some of you that can sow 140. Amen. There's someone that can sow 1,040. Hallelujah. Make sure that there's a 40 in your seed tonight. 240, 540, 740. Amen. Glory to God. But make sure that there's a 40 in your seed tonight. Hallelujah. Seal this word in the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Amen. The other ways that you can sow is PayPal. Some of you may have a card, a debit card, check card, credit card, any type of card, and you don't need a PayPal account to sew on PayPal. I'm almost done. Amen. I'm going to be out you here in a minute, people of God. Hallelujah. But I want to say to each and every one of you, seal this word. PayPal.me slash prophetic impact. Once again, PayPal.me slash one slash forward slash prophetic impact. Hallelujah. I still feel the glory of God. I still feel God moving. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Those of you that sow on Zelle, the number to Zelle and Apple Pay. Amen. Some of you have been sowing on Apple Pay. Glory to God. Whew. I feel the glory of God. Hallelujah. Mm. Apple Pay and um, whew, I'm so filled up. Jesus have mercy. Zelle is 267. 5768358. Once again, 267-576-8358. Hallelujah. 267-576-8358. Write it down. Hallelujah. 267-576-8358. That is for Apple Pay, Zell. Glory to God. Amen. Those of you that want to sow on the ministry's website, you can sow on the website, which is www.propheticimpact1000.com. Once again, www propheticimpact1000.com. Once again, the ministry's website. You can go on there. You can browse testimonies. Amen. You can go on the ministry's website. You can purchase your ministry products as well. You can also book prophetic counseling with yours truly. Amen. I will counsel you in Jesus' mighty name. That's a one-hour session. Amen. Feel free to go to the website. It's www propheticimpact1000.com we also have prophetic mentorship classes amen those classes the fee is 200 amen that's for all four classes october the 1st october the 8th october the 15th and october the 22nd four anointed classes where you will be taught on the prophetic Amen. Some of you can register tonight. After you register, please inbox me to let me know that you have registered for a prophetic mentorship. I'm almost done. Listen, join our prayer line every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday. Every Monday night at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Every Wednesday at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Every Saturday at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Go ahead and follow the ministry. Amen. My page on Facebook is Carmen Haywood. Those of you that want to join this ministry, inbox me. I will send you the email that you can go ahead and join PIPW ministry. Amen. And be connected for real, for real to this powerful anointed ministry. Glory to God. Hallelujah. How many of you have sown tonight? Amen. I want to spend, I want to pray. Amen. A special prayer over your seed. Amen. How many of you have sown tonight? If you sown your seed tonight, I want you to put in the comments, I have sown. Amen. Or sowed. Glory to God. I want to pray. Amen. Over your seed tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Once again, the information is at the bottom of the screen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Everybody should be sowing. Amen. Sister Nacretia said, I have. All right. Sister Nacretia sold. Amen. I'm going to pray a special prayer. Yes, Lord. Over every seed tonight. Hallelujah. Prophetess Cassandra. Amen. Glory to God. Those of you on TikTok, did you plant your seed tonight? Amen. TikTok, it says there's seven that are on tonight. Hallelujah. Get your, your seed of 40 in the ground. Amen. So that's two people that sold tonight. All right. Sister Alanda sold. That's three. Amen. And, and, I'm, and I'm showing you all this for a reason. You know why? Because it's not in the numbers. 
Amen. It's not in the numbers. Many people think that because there's 40 people on the live or 30 people on the live or even 50 people on the live, that everyone sows um, into that ministry or into that profit. They don't. A lot of people eat and run. Amen. A lot of people in the body of Christ, they eat and run, but then they'll go into their churches and they'll sow a thousand dollars into their bishop that preaches for 20 minutes and preaches them happy, a message that they don't even remember. I know. I know. But they'll say, I love my bishop. I love my church. I know. <laughs> they'll say, I love my pastor. I love my church. I know. 20 minutes, 30 minutes of word and no change. Many of you have been set free tonight. Hey, Shanda Basoya. Glory to God. Many of you have come out of darkness tonight. Mm, hallelujah. M many of you have been set free tonight. Many, oh, glory to God. Mm, not just some, but many. Sister Nakresha, Prophetess Cassandra, Sister Alanda, Sister Stacy. Anyone else? Can you pin the links? Um, it should be pinned at the bottom. Sister Stacy is not. On my screen is pinned. On my screen, I can see where it's pinned. Can anybody else see it or you all can't see it? Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I'm going to pray. Whew, God is still moving. Yes, Lord. And some of you were healed by the word tonight. You know, Jesus is the word. Amen. She said, okay, I see it now. Awesome. Awesome. Um, Jesus is the word. Amen. The Bible says in John uh, 1 and 1, amen, that in the beginning was the word. The word was God and the word was with God. Amen. Jesus is the word. Hallelujah. So every time the word is going forth, you're partaking of God. You're receiving God. Amen. Because he is the word. Hallelujah. YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. We got four devices up, Prophetess Cassandra. <laughs> and how many of you know it takes money to do ministry? Uh-oh. I know. I know. Some people would say, you know, well, you know, Jesus paid the price. He did for your salvation. But the anointing is going to cost you something. Amen. It costs all of us something. <laughs> Amen. I got my hands raised too. Glory to God. I'm an abundant giver, abundant sower. Hallelujah. Listen, I just sowed the seed before the before the um the Facebook Live. Amen. And I'm not saying that to 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 get you all to sow. I'm saying that because you can no longer rob God and believe that you're going to be prosperous. It, it doesn't work like that. Hallelujah. And some of you may say, Well, Apostle, I don't have 40. Sow as close as you have to 40. Hallelujah. Amen. Sister Rhonda, those of you that are on, amen, Bella, those of you that are on Instagram, those of you that are on TikTok, you all are still here, but are you sowing? Amen. You all have partook of the word. Amen. But are you sowing? Are you going to seal the word tonight? Hallelujah. Sister Stacy says she just sowed her seed. Amen. Is there anyone else that's going to sow tonight? Amen. We'll give you all 60 seconds. 60 seconds. Amen. And then I'm going to pray. Amen. A special prayer. Amen. Over those who um, have sowed their seed on tonight. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Because see, what you don't want to happen, you don't want the enemy to come and pluck up this word, saints. Amen. You, you don't want the enemy to come and pluck up the word. Is there anyone that desires to sow but don't have it to give? If that's you tonight, then say it. I want to sow, but I don't have it. Somebody may sow for you. Amen. This word was so rich tonight. So rich tonight. So rich tonight. <laughs> this word was so rich tonight. Hallelujah. And I'm so glad my assignment is almost done. Amen. I'm glad that I obey God. And I cannot wait to hear the testimonies. Amen. Of what God is going to do in many of you's lives. Amen. I'm telling you. Amen. She said rich soil, life change, and real profit indeed. Thank you, Apostle. You're welcome, Prophetess. You're welcome. You're welcome. Amen. Twyla Bryant on TikTok says, I want to sow, but I don't have it. Amen, Twyla. Amen. Thank you for that. Amen. Is there anyone that can sow a seed for Sister Twyla? 
Amen. Is there anyone that can sow that $40 seed for Twyla on TikTok? Amen. Glory to God. Is there anyone that can sow? Amen for Sister Twyla. Glory to God. Is there anyone else? Amen. That doesn't have the seed to sow tonight, but you want to seal the word tonight. Glory to God. Amen. I believe it's a few of you. Amen. Listen, you have not because you ask not. God bless you, Sister Shamika. Amen. I'm almost done. It's almost one in the morning. Amen. And I got to go. Got to get off of here. Hallelujah. But I thank God for it. I thank God for this word tonight. Come on, somebody. We got 30 more seconds. Amen. 30 more seconds and we're going to pray out. Mm. Hallelujah. Is there anyone that can sow? Amen. A seed for twilight on tonight. Amen. Thank you all for the hearts. Come on, send up some gifts and some hearts. Amen. On, um, all right, Sister Lene just sold her seed. Amen. And Sister Lene, I'm going to release the rest of that. Amen. And I'm going to sow the rest for you so that that seed is 40. All right. I'm going to sow the rest, Sister Lene. I saw what just came through. Amen. I'm going to sow the rest for you, Sister Lene. Amen. I'm going to do that. Amen. Amen. I'll release that for you. Amen. So that it will be 40. Hallelujah. The coming out seed. My God, my God. Ooh, hallelujah. Mm. Thank you, Jesus. Y'all just looking at me like I'm crazy. <laughs> Ain't nobody saying nothing. It's all right. It is okay. How many of you received the word tonight? Did you receive the word? If you received the word, hit those hearts for Jesus. Come on, hit those hearts for the Lord. Hallelujah. And as you're hitting those hearts, tell God thank you. Come on, as, you, as you're hitting those hearts, tell God thank you. Come on, tell the Lord thank you. Tell him thank you. Woo, a word of coming out. See that? It's time. Hallelujah. The time is now. You're going to remember this day. Amen. You're going to remember this day. 9-10-2024. My God, my God. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Ah, uh, he's so faithful. Hallelujah. God is so faithful. Mm, 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 mm. And you know, he's a promise keeper. Amen. Is there anyone that desires to sow tonight and you, you don't have it? Just put it in the comments, please, so that somebody can sow for you. Amen. Come on. No more pride in this season. <laughs> How are you still prideful after a word like that? <laughs> Come on here. Somebody said, did the apostle just say I got the spirit of pride? Yes. Yes, that's pride. Don't be prideful. Come on. Don't be prideful. Amen. Just say, I want to seal the word, but I don't have it. You know, we're a family here. Amen. We're a family. Come on. Right, Minister Adam? We are a family. Hallelujah. The family of God. Amen. The body of Christ. Glory to God. Come on. See what happens when you don't say nothing. Now we got to wait. <laughs> Just say something. That was preached on the prayer line too. Open your mouth. <laughs> Hallelujah. Open your mouth. Come on. Come on, people of God. Is there anyone else that's sowing tonight? Come on. Amen. Minister Adam said I'm sowing. Amen. I'm going to put his name down as well. Thank you, Minister Adam. Glory to God. I'm going to pray. Amen. I decided to sow, but don't have it. Amen. Amen. So Brother Antonio said he wants to sow, but he doesn't have it tonight. Amen. He wants to seal the word. Is there anyone that can sow a seed for Brother Antonio? Hallelujah. Amen. We'll give it a few more seconds. Is there anyone that can sow a seed for Brother Antonio? Amen. Even if it's a $10 seed. Amen. It is something. Amen. Something. Glory to God. Amen. And name that seed. Hallelujah. Name that seed coming out. Amen. This is my coming out seed. Glory to God. Is there anyone that can sow for Brother Antonio and Sister Twyla? 
Y'all got me repeating myself like a parrot. I know out of 18 people, somebody else can sow for a man, a man of God, Brother Antonio, and somebody can sow for Sister Twyla. Come on. Really? <laughs> Come on, people of God. What you do for somebody else, God in turn would do for you. Believe me, it's coming back. It's coming back sooner than you think, actually. Hallelujah. I've sowed seeds. I've sowed seeds for others and it came right back. Literally. Not even within 24 hours. Whew. I know what God can do. Hallelujah. <laughs> Amen. I done preached already. Let me try to bring it on down. Hallelujah. Amen. Prophetess Cassandra says, I will sow. Amen. So you're going to sow for Brother Antonio. Amen. Who's going to sow for Sister Twyla? Amen. Can someone sow a seed for Sister Twyla? And it's T-W-I-L-A. Amen. We're close to 40 and a half. Be okay. Yes. Yes, Stacy Styles. Yes. Yes. Stacy, that is fine. Amen. Just sow something to seal the word. Amen. So if you're going to sow half of it, that's fine, Stacy. Amen. And let me put your name down. You know what, Stacy Styles? I will go ahead and put the other half. If I got to clear out my savings account, I'll do it. It's okay. Amen. I know that God blesses the obedient ones. If I don't know anything else, I'm telling you all, he always blesses. Amen. Minister Adam sowed his seed. God bless you, Minister Adam. Amen. Stacy. Stacy Styles, yes. Okay, Stacy, you can go ahead. Do you have the information to sow on TikTok? Glory to God. Prophet Chanel, would you be so kind to post the information on TikTok, please? Amen. For the few that are on TikTok that may want to sow tonight. Amen. It, yep, it always comes back. Amen. Adrian says she sold for you, Minister Derek. Amen. All right, Sister Stacy sold for Twyla. Praise God. Thank you so much, Sister Stacy. See? See that? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And you know, even when you bless somebody else and be a blessing to someone else and sow for them, there's a release that God gives you. Amen. There's a release that I'm telling you. Hallelujah. You sh and you know what? Thank you, Lord. Sister Stacy, you felt that. Even when you sold for her, glory to God, there was a release even in your spirit. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Getting you ready for the new. Getting you ready for the abundance. Amen. It's Sister Stacy, as you just sold for Twyla, amen, something happened. Something just happened. Amen. In the realm of the spirit. Hallelujah. And God is saying he's getting you ready for the new. You'll get ready to step into the new, um, Sister Stacy. Hallelujah. Something just broke for you in the realm of the spirit. Hallelujah. Something just broke for you. Glory to God. Okay, Brother Antonio, thank you so much. Amen. Um, Prophetess Cassandra, amen, for sowing for Brother Antonio, hallelujah, amen, we have Minister Derek, amen, we have Brother Antonio, we have Minister Derek, Sister Twyla, Minister Adam, amen, Sister Nacretia, Prophetess Cassandra, Sister Alanda, amen, Twyla said thank you, Sister Stacy. she said thank you on TikTok, amen, she said thank you. All right, we have Alanda and Sister Stacy. Amen. Did I forget anyone? Did I forget anyone? Amen. The seed amount tonight is 40. And name your seed coming out. Hallelujah. I'm coming out with the victory in my hand. Amen. Glory to God. God bless you, Prophet Rod Terry. Blessings to you. Amen. Hallelujah. We thank God. Amen. For the Prophet. Hallelujah. Listen, y'all, he's one of my prophets. Amen. <laughs> so don't y'all try to go take him. Amen. And I say that, amen, um, humbly. Amen. The prophet has prophesied over my life. Whew. Oh, my goodness. I want to say we've been connected over 14 years. Mm -hmm. Over 14 years. And every word, amen, that has come out of his mouth, amen, um, has come to pass. Amen. Every word spoken. Hallelujah. Amen. Through the spirit of God. Hallelujah has come to pass. And so I thank God. Amen. For true prophets in my life. Hallelujah. This is why I encourage you all stay connected to your prophet. 
Hallelujah. Stay connected to your prophet. Why? Amen. Because God speaks to your prophet concerning you. Amen. And sometimes you'll get confirmation. You'll get the confirmation that you need. And it helps you to stay focused. Amen. It helps you to stay focused in the realm of the spirit. Glory to God. So, amen. This is good ground. Hallelujah. Amen. This is good ground. Thank you, prophet. Amen. God bless you too. Amen. God bless you as well. Hallelujah. May the Lord increase you as well, prophet. Amen. In this season, hallelujah, of your personal life and your ministry. Glory to God. I hear the Lord saying, prophet, right? Hallelujah. In your personal life. Glory to God. Something great is getting ready to happen for you. Hallelujah. In your personal life and your ministry. Glory to God. Two, twofold blessing. <laughs> Hallelujah. It is a twofold blessing. Amen. That's getting ready to happen in your life, Prophet Rod. Mm hmm. Hallelujah. And we thank God for it. Amen. Anyone else sowing tonight? Amen. The seed amount is 40. All right. Get your best seed in the ground. You can sow 140, 540, 1,040. Amen. I challenge that one person. Hallelujah. I believe it, Prophet Chanel. Amen. Prophet Chanel been speaking of that thousand dollar seed for the last two weeks. Glory to God. There's someone on here. Hallelujah. That can sow. Amen. That thousand dollar seed. You're here. You're here. Hallelujah. It's been spoken. Mm -hmm. It's been spoken. Amen. Hallelujah. There's someone on here. You can sow that thousand and forty. Mm -hmm. Easy. <laughs> Hallelujah. I remember when I sold my last thousand dollar seed. Amen. And I've sold seven of them. Just to let you all know. <laughs> Amen. I'm up to my seventh thousand dollar seed. Glory to God. And guess what, Minister Adam? I'm believing God for another thousand dollar seed to sow. Y'all, y'all not, y'all not hearing me tonight. That would be the eighth one. <laughs> Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Glory to God. And I can't, hey, Shanda Basoya. Yes, Lord, I hear you. I can't wait to sow a million dollars. What you say? <laughs> Hallelujah. Glory. I'm talking about a million dollar seed. See, 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 see. Somebody may say a million dollars, apostle. Yes. Yes. And yes. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And I know, amen, some people right now that I'm going to bless. Amen. <laughs> Hallelujah. Prophet Cornell said, I know what she's talking about. Come on here. See, 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 that's what I'm saying. Hallelujah. Because guess what? God blesses us to bless the kingdom. Come on here. Listen, no, I'm getting ready to say something. Jesus, have mercy. L let me let me encourage you all. See, we're the body of Christ. But how many of you know, even the satanic world, they sow into darkness. Halloween. Let me tell you all something. They are this and they sowing up throughout the year. So that their Halloween rituals and things like that and all the darkness that they do, it, 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 it comes together. They have no problem. Come on here. <laughs> but we in the house of God, we have to keep, come on here. We got to keep seed in the ground. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. We have to keep the kingdom of God going. Amen. And we got to continue. We have to continue to sow because it comes back to us anyway, anyway. Hallelujah. It comes back to us. Every time we sow, it's a kingdom principle, right? Give and it shall be given unto you. What? Good measure, pressed down, shaken together, running over, shall what? Men give unto your bosom. For with the same measure you have given, it shall be given back to you in return, right? Come on. So, so it comes back to you anyway. Hallelujah. Listen, glory to God. I'm going to give you all this and we're going to pray. Hallelujah. Your seed, amen, leaves your hand, but it never leaves your life. Hey, I'm going to say that again. Glory to God. Listen, your seed leaves your hand, but it never leaves your life. Oh, that's good right there. <laughs> Hallelujah. Listen, my seed will leave my hand because I'm, because I'm giving it. I'm giving it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm giving out of what I already have. Mm. Hallelujah. So, so, so it leaves my hand, but it never leaves my life. Woo. Cause it's coming back to me. <laughs> hey, hallelujah. Listen, we trying to exit y'all. We trying to get off of here. Woo. Glory to God. A thousand dollar seeds is when my apostle Jackson was alive and I was going to be able to do it again. Amen. Amen. I know that's right. I know that's right. Listen, you know, 
Glory to God. Listen, that thousand dollar seed, I'm telling y'all, that, that should be on your um your prayer list. You you should be praying and asking God to give you a thousand dollars to sow into the kingdom. I'm telling you, it will bless your life abundantly. That's a miracle seed. Hallelujah. That that's a miracle. Hallelujah. Supernatural seed. Glory to God. That that not only amen will bless your life, but it'll break up the fallow ground around you, which makes your soil. Mm, hallelujah. So so rich. Glory to God. That every time you sow that thousand dollars, God, He just He just listen. He touches your soil. He touches your soil. Hallelujah. So everything that is planted in your soil would now produce a harvest harvest. Come on. Mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That harvest will be so plentiful. That harvest will be so great. Hallelujah. And you'll have seeds within that harvest. Come on, somebody. See, this is why we sow. This is why we plant. This is why we give. Amen. Because it keeps our harvest abundant. And I don't know about anybody else, but I thank God for an abundant harvest. Mm. Hey, glory to God. I know mine is coming. <laughs> Hallelujah. I know. Amen. My abundant harvest is coming. Glory to God. So, yes, Lord. Somebody needs to sow for your business. Glory to God. I'm trying to let it go. Amen. There's someone on here. You want your business to prosper. Amen. So for your business. So for your business. Name your seed. My business will prosper. Hallelujah. Come on. Put a declaration on that seed. My business will prosper. This is my business seed. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory to God. There's someone you want your business. It, it, it's a certain level that you want your business to go to. Amen. And it's not there yet. Glory to God. But when you sow, amen, your seed, name your business, um, name your seed, my business will prosper. Amen. My business will prosper. Glory to God. Those of you on TikTok, we get ready to go TikTok. Hallelujah. Prophet of Chanel says, if I had that seed to release it, amen. Can someone sow a seed for Prophet of Chanel? We almost done. We almost done, y'all. We, we done. We're done. We're done. We're done. We're going to cap it right here. We're going to cap it right here. Hallelujah. For everyone that's on, yes, Lord. The Lord says everyone should be sowing tonight. Everyone should be sowing a seed this morning. Every person that's on here. Hallelujah. He has a harvest in mind for you. Glory to God. Mm -hmm. She said, that's definitely my business. Amen, Sister Stacy. Release that seed. Amen. And name your seed. My business will prosper. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Can someone sow for Prophetess Chanel? Amen. She's on TikTok. She's been kicked off of Facebook, y'all, because y'all know she would be right here with us. Amen. But she's on TikTok tonight. Can someone sow a seed for Prophet of Chanel? Amen. Tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Listen. Who Shanda Basoya. Glory to God. I heard double, then I heard triple. Amen. I heard double, then I heard triple. Double and triple. Double, then triple. Double and triple. Mm. Glory to God. Double, double blessings, triple blessings. Amen. That's two blessings in one, three blessings. Amen. In one. Ooh. My God. You know what, daughter Chanel? I'm sewing for you. <laughs> Hallelujah. Let me write that down. Amen. I got three people. Amen. That I'm going to sew for mm -hmm. tonight. That's my triple blessings. Now, don't y'all be hating. <laughs> Hallelujah. Come on. Don't get mad. Amen. Do, do not get mad. Amen. When the apostle is blessed, I'm sewing for some people tonight. I'm trying to let y'all have it. Hallelujah. Prophet Chanel said the building fund a thousand. Someone can sow five hundred. Someone can sow three fifty. And someone can sow two fifty. Where you at tonight? I'm trying to let this go. I really am, so we can pray out. Amen. Prophet said the glory is in the room. Woo. My God tonight. Glory to God. Prophet Chanel, I'm telling you, someone's going to sow that thousand dollar seed. Someone is going to sow that thousand dollar seed into our building fund. Mm -hmm. I believe God. I believe God. Listen, they, there may be a millionaire that is on this live tonight. There may be a millionaire that's going to watch the replay. Amen. Prophet Cornell said there's a five thousand dollar seed on here. Amen. I believe God. Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, YouTube. I got four devices up, y'all. Instagram, Facebook, it, no, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. <laughs> Amen. Prophetess Cassandra, your pastor got four devices up, and we working all of them. 
<laughs> Hallelujah. It's souls everywhere. Woo, Shanda Basoya. Hallelujah. I feel a shifting in the atmosphere. I'm trying to let it go. Hallelujah. But it's souls. Glory to God. Mm. Hey, Shanda Basoya. You know, the Bible says, he that winneth souls is wise. Oh, God. Mm. I feel another shifting in the atmosphere, Prophet Cornell. Hallelujah. Prophet Rod, I feel a shifting in this atmosphere tonight. Glory to God. I'm getting ready to add some of the prophets on here. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? <laughs> We done already had the prophetic round table. Amen. We, listen. Glory to God. Listen, we done already had, amen, even on TikTok the other night. Hallelujah. We had the, the company of prophets. Mm. My God, my God. Listen, we had the company. Hey, Shanda Basoya. Yes, Lord, I hear you. Hallelujah. For he is formulating his prophets together now. Mm, glory to God. Listen, hallelujah. Woo, Shanda Basoya. Listen, I got this around my waist, Prophet Chanel. Hallelujah. I'm Prophet Chanel, Prophet Cassandra. Amen. I have this prayer to lead. Amen. Around my waist. Glory to God. Hallelujah. So whoever, glory to God. Amen. Purchase a prayer to lead. Amen. You won't get this pink, white, and gold one right here. Mm. Kaya Shanda Basoya. It's been around my waist the whole life. Woo. Glory, 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 glory. All right, all right, all right. I just felt led to say that. Amen. Mm. Hallelujah. I feel a shift in, in the atmosphere. Listen, we're going to let it go tonight. Amen. We're going to let it go. We're going to let it go. We're going to let it go. Amen. And when I say let it go, meaning we're going to close out the offering at this time. Hallelujah. It's, has everyone gotten their seed in the ground? Prophet Chanel, I'm going to sow for you, daughter. Amen. I'm going to sow a seed for you tonight. Amen. Glory to God. And I'm going to, I'm going to stretch it. I'm going to sow another $40 seed. Amen. Prayer line is ready. <laughs> Amen. Oh, right now, really profit. <laughs> Ain't trying to get on the prayer line. Listen, I feel another win. You know what? I feel another win. I feel it. I feel it. <laughs> Glory. Hallelujah. Prophet Rod, you still on with us? Hallelujah. Prophet Cornell said, so let's get on the prayer line. <laughs> Whoo, Shanda Basoya. I, I feel it. I feel a wind. Whoo, I feel a fresh wind. Mm, 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 mm. My God, tonight. Mm, 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 mm. -mm. Amen. Let us pray. Glory to God. Father, in the name of Jesus, Father, we thank you tonight, Father. We thank you for this word. We thank you for this offering, Lord God. We thank you, Father, for each and every person that has given on tonight. Hallelujah, God. Every person that has sold into your kingdom and has sealed the word tonight, Father, we thank you right now, Lord. You said in your word that you would send some 30, some 60, some hundredfold blessings upon your people, Lord God. So we thank you right now for the hundredfold. I speak the hundredfold blessings upon every seed that has been sown on tonight in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you that we are no longer in the wilderness. Hallelujah, God. We thank you, hallelujah, that yes, we have been tried in the fire, but we have come out, with it, hallelujah, with the victory in our hands. Father, we thank you even now that we have come out with victory. Hallelujah. We've come out. Glory to God. Mm. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. With a major victory. Yes, God, I hear you. Hallelujah. We thank you for this major victory, God, that is in front of us. Glory to God. We thank you, Father God, that yes, Lord. Hallelujah. This word, Lord God, has, has been, amen, even, um, a celebratory word, Lord God. <clears throat> Hallelujah. Father, we thank you right now, God, that even as we exit this place, but not from your presence, Father, that you are with us, Lord God, that you'll never leave us nor forsake us. Father, I thank you right now for every person that has joined the live tonight, whether it be on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, in the name of Jesus, and even those that are going to watch the replay, Father, we thank you for this word, Lord God. Hallelujah. That it will penetrate the hearts of your people, that it would encourage them and remind them that yes, they their faith has been tested. Yes, they've been thrown in the fire, but they have come out with the victory in their hands. Father, we decree and declare now your manifold blessings over each and every person. I decree and declare now divine healing. I decree and declare now, God, that you are continuing to move in your people's life. And it's in Jesus' mighty name I pray. And I seal this prayer in the blood of Jesus and I count it done. I bind every spirit of backlash and retaliation. Hallelujah. That will come against myself, my family, my children, even my possessions, Satan, the 
the Lord rebuke you. You have no power and no dominion in Jesus' mighty name. I cover the people of God in the blood of Jesus now for no weapon. Mm, hallelujah. That is formed against us will be able to prosper. Every tongue that rises up against us in judgment, God will condemn. And it's in Jesus' mighty name we pray for we have the victory. And it's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen and amen. God bless each and every one of you. Have a wonderful night and a wonderful morning. And remember that Jesus Christ is Lord. God bless you. Good night, everyone.